As Marvel continues to expand the MCU, we seem to be getting projects we never thought we would get. Enter X-Men 97, a sequel to the original X-Men The Animated Series, but this time produced by Marvel Studios. One thing that stuck out ever since the announcement was the direct involvement of everybody that's on hand with all the MCU stuff. So now one of the people involved with the series addresses the MCU canon status. So this comes from a recent interview and multiple quotes that have hit the internet. And essentially what's revealed by the man in charge of the project, aka the writing of the project, is the fact that nothing can be revealed right now. But if you want the full answer, and the extent that Marvel Studios is going into bringing back the series and how it might tie into things, you are going to have to watch the first season all the way up until the end. Then continuing to say that they're not sure how the marketing is going to handle it, but there is a degree that people will be asking that question and what this means. Now again, while we don't know anything, I think many people automatically assumed that once Disney announced it's a Marvel Studios property and they keep saying the multiverse is going to factor into everything, animation, a couple things on the outside like comics that are going to become canon, such as the Captain Carter comic that they seem to be hinting will be full canon to her What If story and possible other projects. I think it's safe to say that X-Men 97 will in some way connect to the bigger multiverse but not necessarily cross over into the MCU proper because, well, that wouldn't really make sense, would it? What I could honestly see is maybe some of the what if characters, like a Captain Carter, for example, or somebody like that, ending up in that universe and contributing to that plot. So in a way, it's part of the MCU because what if builds off of that, but then this continues its own tale and you kind of get characters there. And don't forget, for a while now, we've been hearing that Marvel Studios wants to do animation just like they did DMCU, aka have an entire universe that's interconnected that's all animated. Maybe X-Men 97 is the first step of that, and then they're going to bring in other characters and sort of build out that shared universe like Fox used to have back in the day, where Spider-Man was set in it, and then the Avengers cartoon was set in it. And of course, you had Silver Surfer, the Fantastic Four, Iron Man, Hulk... But this time, they can do it without outside interference, and it's all them. Which, honestly, I do think is the goal, and that's kind of going to be the big reveal at the end. <laughs>